Hey everybody, we have the lens hound with the belt drive clamped up on our rod system. And uh, I'm going to, before powering on, I'm just going to, you can just loosen it, but I'm going to disengage the belt just to show you. I'm powering up, powering up the transmitter. That takes eight seconds. You notice the red light comes on and the backlight LEDs start flashing. Uh, the, you'll notice that we have over our cinema lens, this is our 85 millimeter prime, uh, we've got the latex band because this is a hard gear uh, plastic and this hard plastic against the two tends to slip. So this is a good application for the latex band. If you have a rubberized grip on a DSLR lens, you don't need the uh, latex band. Okay, so now we're powered up, tighten the belt, just that's all the tension you need. And uh, so now you notice the red LED is illuminated in the encoder knob. This indicates we're in calibrate mode, and this is the only motor control you have. This doesn't do anything, and that's the power-up state. You need to calibrate before you do anything. Now, in calibrate mode, only in calibrate, this switch functions as kind of a gear. Uh, this is extreme movement, this is mid-range, and then this is very fine movement. So I'll move to extreme for right now. If we do that most of the time. And this is the out position. And now it moves to wherever the knob is. That's in free run, or that's in Z mode. Now I'm in free run. And so there I'm calibrated. If at any time you want to re enter calibration, just hold the encoder knob down a couple seconds, it flashes. And when it's red, you're good to go again. Now, one interesting thing is if I choose whatever position you choose first, that's going to be your counterclockwise extreme position. And when the second position, that's going to be your clockwise. So if you want to reverse the direction that your lens is moving or your motor is moving, just reverse the order of what you encode. I could start with infinity first and then go to close focus. I tend to like to have close focus on the left and far focus on the right. And I'm going to switch over here first. I didn't do that last time. And now when it goes into free run, it does, the lens doesn't go slinging around to the other side. I've got it kind of where I want it. So there I am, calibrated in free run. That's it.